Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the old lady, and this is The Loyal, episode 14 of a San Diego Loyal Save. So how's it been going? Well, actually, it's gone pretty well. It's gone pretty well. Uh, after we played Portland 2 in the last episode, we played Colorado Springs. Um, goals from Gallardo and Martin and Martin got, got us um, the win. Then we played New York City FC and lost 2-0. They're just too good for us. Uh, both the New York teams, we lost 1-3 to them and 0-2 to them. They're just too good for us. They, they, they really are. And that's why I really am worried about us getting promoted this season. I hope we don't get promoted. Um, that would be, I think, a disaster for us. Anyway, we went on to play Austin FC. Yusuf Dow got the goal late to um, tie up the game. So at least we got a point out of it. We beat San Antonio at home. Carlos Alvarez potting a penalty. We beat Hartford 5-0 with Rubio Rubin grabbing 4 and Alvarez with a penalty. In the 11, we beat 1-0, Brian Garcia getting the only goal. And today we face the San Diego Flash. Now they are not in our league, and I mean that in, in every sense. They are in the Pacific National League, which is, I think, let's see if we can figure out how far down below us it is. That's can we go lower? No, I don't think you can go lower than the National Leagues. No, you can't. So that's Tier 9. They're at Tier 9. Atlantic and Western Premier League. There's the Premier League, so that's Tier 8. National League Division 2, National League Division 1, that's 7 and 6. National Premier, that's five. League two is four. League one is three. Championship is two. So these guys are from seven tiers below us. But it is a local derby. So, you know, I mean, I thought it would be fun to play. Um, so let's see who we've got. I think I've picked a team that is um, not, oh, that's right, I forgot. He can't play today because he is injured. Uh, we'll stick Wayne Martin on the bench, backup goalkeeper. Um, our goalkeeper, uh, Amal Knight, is on international duty with Jamaica at the World Cup. Um, so he won't be back until mid-December. And um, Jude, is it Jake Fenlison? Jen, Jake Fenlison, that's it, um, is out with a twisted ankle and will be out for another three weeks. So we're on our number three goalkeeper, <clears throat> yeah. But again, this is a team from well below us. So um, a little bit of a rotated team today, Jack Metcalf, Grant Stoneman, Modesto Monde Mendez, and Justin Bellieu make up the, mid the defense, I should say. Uh, Luis Ernesto Ruiz, Charlie Adams, and Valentino Salduco make up the midfield. Sher Mohamed on the right, Joe Gallardo on the left, and Yusuf Dow up front. Rubio Rubin's on the bench with his 20 goals, but we're going to see if Dow can get it done today. Let's hope so. <clears throat> Excuse me. And is there anything here I need to see? Opposition instructions, I'll take that. Team instructions, I'm not changing anybody because I picked them carefully. It's a rotated side for a rotated game. I mean, you know, there's seven tiers below us. It, it's really not something that should be a, a problem for us to beat these guys. So, uh, I expect nothing but a win from this match to keep our run going. And we got one focused. Okay. Let's try focus. Oh, they didn't like that. 
overwhelmed by the feedback. Not good. Oh dear. There you go. Got it back. Mohammed Adams. Salduko Gallardo. Whoa, nice passing. Salduko back for Ruiz Adams. Through ball for Mohammed. Nice try. Goalkeeper gets down well to save it. I think we we'll definitely go attacking on this team. Don't think there's any good reason not to. There we go now. Let's get it back up there. Good play. Billia and Dow manages to head it over. That's a little frustrating. Ruiz. Belia, oh, back out. Ruiz, back inside for Metcalf and back out again. Saluco tries to reset. And he does. Dow gets the ball, bounces past the goalkeeper, and he manages to tap it in at the far post. Gotta love that. That's a happy thing. Salduco to Ruiz. Ruiz's ball popped over the top. Goalkeeper just misses it completely and Dow finishes it. I don't need to see it a third time. So that's off to a good start. I'm glad when Dow scores because it means I don't necessarily have to bring in Rabin in this game, and he can actually have a rest, which would be nice. He doesn't get a rest very often. Well, not a very good ball forward, but picked up. Gallardo plays it in, can't find his man. So Luco recovers. Gets it to Metcalf. Inside for Adams. Salduco gets back. Gallardo to Adams to Mohamed to the shot, which it doesn't get through. Metcalf, Adams, Ruiz. Just passing the ball around fluently here. This is lovely. Mohamed, and he scores. But he's offside. That's too bad. Yeah, he was definitely offside. I saw that. Okay. Mendez all the way back to his keeper. He's had nothing to do today so far, which is good. You like that when you're on to your third keeper. If he gets to just stand and go there and do the crossword, I'm happy. Oh, what a finish. Dow. Another beautiful ball chipped over the top and Dow finishes it gorgeously. That's a really hard ball to do too. The um, volley with the ball coming over your shoulder like that that's that's just really hard to do that takes amazing timing so what a volley what a goal happy days we got a 2.4 xg so we're full measure for the for the lead um, I'm going to say I'm happy with the way things are going, but it's probably just going to make them happy and then they're going to get complacent again once the 10 minutes is up. And 
another two minutes and it should be reverting to complacency. Oh dear, missed it. Dow shot just over the bar. And there it goes. Back to complacent in the back three there. Oh dear, that is not a good ball. Oh my. Okay, good. Oh, I never noticed that. We're, we're SD and they're SD. How'd... Oh right, yeah, because we're both San Diego. That's funny. Not very helpful, but it is funny. Offside. Yeah. Okay, anybody need to come out? Nobody needs to. Anybody playing badly? Metcalf. Menta. And that's about it. Nobody else is playing badly or very tired, so let's let them roll. Everybody's held up well across this game. Didn't tire ourselves out at all. And look at that. What a great pressure all the way through the game. 2.8 on the XG. Not bad when we scored 2. Then we had 0.3 and did not score, so not a big surprise. Very happy with the result, and we played. That's good. So we've won that. I am happy with that. That is excellent. Hurrah! And Rubio Ravine didn't have to come in. So we are up in fourth place now. I can't believe we're in fourth place. Uh, we have a game in hand over the team ahead of us. Um, but that would only take us to one point behind if we won it. And uh, I just don't know if we're going to be able to hang in and stick up there with them. Um, New York and, and them. So I personally am hoping we end up back in seventh because I don't think we're ready to go up yet. And the reason that I say that, let's have a look at my squad here. Uh, general info. There we go. My most expensive player is 500k and it's Rubio Rubin. So Let's just look at some of the teams that came down from relegation this year. Okay. Their cheapest player is 325k. Their second cheapest is as expensive as Rubio Rubin. The most expensive is worth 19.75 million. That's absolutely nuts. There's no way we can compete with that. So, and they've got players from what I assume are on loan from Man City. Yep. On loan from Man City. On loan from Man United. On loan from Man City. Man City. And Atlanta United. So almost all of them, four of the six loanees come from Man City. And there's another one, sorry, there's a seven. On loan from Chivas. So four of the seven are on loan from Man City. And they are worth millions. So I really don't think we're set to go up yet. 
we just we're just not good enough yet to to be able to um, to hold our own at that level I'm fairly sure so anyway that's gonna do it for this episode I'm gonna quickly peek over here and tell you where we come back Lulu, Lulu. Um, I'm thinking probably the US Cup third round I don't know who it's going to be uh, can we see if we can find out quickly rules third round draw date November 20th uh, see that's another four days away and I suspect we've got a game between now and then um, yes no we don't no it's tomorrow okay well no sorry we can do that let's go look at that let's do that oh I have to do the press conference all right hang on a second I'll be right back okay here's the draw uh, there's gonna be 81 teams drawn so we're gonna do this fairly quickly oh there we go and we've got another San Diego team this time from League Two but we're going with another San Diego Derby that's crazy talk anyway so we will be facing a San Diego Derby again and I think that's kind of exciting so that's that is definitely where we'll come back we will come back for the San Diego match because why wouldn't we I mean that's that's just too much fun so I will play the offline games over the weekend and I'll be back with San Diego 1904 on Monday I hope that you've enjoyed the episode I want to thank you very much for your time I do appreciate it I hope that you have a great day and take care